Hey guys and welcome to another how-to video. In this one here, I'm going to be showing you guys really quickly how to add Snapchat filters to your webcam in Streamlabs OBS or OBS software. Now it's super easy and only takes a few minutes. All you need to do is go to Google, type in Snapchat camera, download the app, install it until you see this, what you see on your screen right now in my video. Once you've installed it, you'll be able to go through and select different filters to make yourself look beautiful, ugly, or funny. <laughs> So you've got that, you've got the um, app open. What you want to do next is open Streamlabs OBS. Now I'm starting with a new scene. I have no sources here. What I'm going to do is um, add a new source and it's going to be a video capture device, add source, and I'm going to call it Snapchat camera. Add the source. Once you've done that, what you need to do is uh, click on the drop down for device and click on snap camera. And here you see here my uh, my webcam has popped up and I've got the Snapchat filter activated. So but then you want to click on done and um, you can transform this to make it uh, fit to the screen. So it's like this. Hey guys, what this will allow you to do is open up the Snapchat app and um, click on some filters and this will show on your stream. So it's a really cool way to add some dynamics to your stream, um, make your viewers laugh or cry or whatever. Um, it's just a way for you to mess about with the filters. The one thing that might happen with you guys is that you might already have a cam loaded down below in the sources area, a normal webcam, and you want to change it to a Snapchat filter cam. So what you could do is, um, say for example, I had a cam here, and this cam was a normal camera, right? It'll be this one here. It's not going to load up because um, my cam's already in use. But what you'd do is right click, this is the same in OBS as well. I'm using Streamlabs OBS, but it's the same in OBS. Right click, go to properties and change this drop down to snap camera on your normal camera and it will automatically change it to the filter cam. If I close the app, you'll see this. So you don't want this to happen. If you're streaming and you close the app by accident or something, uh, this is what the viewers will see. So you don't want this to happen. So make sure the app is always open when you've got the Snapchat filter camera enabled so i hope this helped you guys if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you don't like it give it a thumbs down don't do that it's very bad comment down below if you appreciate the content or want to know more um, feel free to check out my twitch it's twitch.tv slash devk i live stream three days a week wednesday friday and saturday follow me on social media links are down in the description below and i'll catch you guys in the next one peace how about that I'm all out. I'm all out. I'm all out.